There cannot be a more unfortunate ship on the ocean but the one that is sunk by her own captain. It was a tradition during the voyages of the 16th century that the captain of the ship goes down with it. The ultimate example of love with the ship and an extreme symbol of responsibility for the ship's safety. Oynes Prehaw, the modern multi-million dollar corvette, very young of its age, armed with modern weaponry and built indigenously at Goa, was damaged and sunk in a head-on collision with a merchant vessel 10 nautical miles off the Indian coast around 9.45 a.m. on April 21st. After the head-on collision, all 73 personnel aboard the warship were rescued before it sank. The naval ship turned to its port side left when it came face to face with the container ship violating basic navigational norms that the two ships coming face to face have to turn to the starboard side which is the right side to avoid the collision. When INS Prahar turned left, it hit the container ship which according to the maritime law was turning to its right side to avoid a collision expecting the naval ship do the same. The warship was a 56 meter long wheel class missile corvette commissioned just in 1997 with a range of 2000 nautical miles especially aimed at Pakistan naval ships and keeping their activities close to the shore. The disgraceful exit of the Indian war machine has drawn international attention to the unprofessional training and handling of the warfare equipment by the Indian armed forces along with doubts surrounding the quality of shipbuilding indigenously by India at Goa. We conclude the mega disasters of the Indian Navy here till another one happens on the Indian seas. If you like the video, do like, subscribe and support. Hit the bell button to get notifications whenever a new video is uploaded. That's all for today on Adilas Bhatt Cockpit.